Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I thought I'd share with you uh, the last project I worked on before I discovered the junk journal adventure. So I used to make mini albums uh, out of chipboard and cardstock for our, uh, our travels. I had a lot of photos and I always did some albums, but this is the last one, so I'll show you this one and eventually maybe I'll make a video on others if you're interested. Um, so this, when I saw this paper collection from Ciao Bella, I just had called Under the Tuscan Sun. I just had to get it to make my, uh, uh, my album for when we went to Tuscany. And I keep everything, so this was perfect. So it's a, it's a trifold with lots of magnets. And that's another thing. That's why the albums are so heavy. Uh, they are he very heavy because of the magnets, because of the chipboard, because of the cardstock and the papers on top. So you can, I'm sure for all of you that are scrapbookers, you know exactly what I'm talking about. So this is why... When I discovered junk journaling, I thought, oh my God, how much easier. I mean, there's no measuring. There's no, uh, this, this was becoming, uh, you have to be precise in your measurement. If, well, I'm a perfectionist, so for me, and it takes me such a long time to, to finish a, a project. I'm not a good engineer at uh, preparing all my albums. It takes me a long time. But anyway, I love the uh, the end uh, the end results, and I thought I'd sh share it with you. So it was a continuing uh, of the papers, and inside here, uh, on the left side, I have a, a huge envelope um, that's holding with magnets. I have magnets here, and I have magnets there, and uh, this contains all. Like I said, I keep everything. So I have in here a pocket and I have a little booklet that I'm going to be making uh, to transcribe. I'm going to make a, a little junk journal because when I did this, I didn't have, I didn't know how to make junk journals, but now I'll be able to write down uh, because every time we travel, I keep a journal anyway. So you can ask me exactly how much we paid uh, for the hotel, the restaurant. Uh, I know everything because I keep everything. Uh, so I'll be making a little journal in here and just to show you how, um, you know, like this was a, a restaurant that we went to in San Gimigiano. This is our hotel in Florence, our hotel in uh, San Gimigiano, Cortona. This is our entrance uh, to the cathedral, the uh, Duomo in Siena the city map, and so on, so on, so on. So like I said, I keep everything. And, and that's why I made this pouch. On this page here, it's just the introduction to, uh, I cut out the little window in here and I put some um, little ephemeras in there. I thought, yeah, why not? <laughs> so I've got little uh, from the, because the paper collection was so, so beautiful. I wanted to use almost everything. And I bought two 12 by 12, so I have some leftovers and I'll probably do a junk journal. Why not? The middle here uh, has a, a large pocket and I'm that's from the paper collection as well. It's a little booklet. And I put all, all our postcards in there. I have much more, but I, you know, I just keep a few because eventually, like I said, it weighs way, way, way too much. Here in the middle, I made a waterfall because I want to put some of our photos in here. So I'll be making, uh, I, I just have to print some of the photos that I want to keep. Uh, and so at least when I look at my journal, I, I, I have my photos, which I like very much to, to do. So this was my little waterfall that goes right in here. And on the side here, another large pocket with more of the ephemeras, another little booklet that I'll probably gonna make into a, a journal so I can, I'll have more space to write. Oops, and there's another. I mean, I mean, look at this. Isn't this gorgeous? I, and red is one of my favorite colors. 
And this is the back, another flip, and with another lar large pocket where I kept uh, uh, more things, uh, all the en our entrances to museums and uh, more postcards. So anyway, you understand uh, what, I, what I do. So this, this is why. I used to make uh, mini albums so that's it and this was a lot of work a lot a lot a lot of work but the end result is beautiful I think anyway it's not everybody's cup of tea but it's oops that's the envelope so so here you go this was my under the Tuscan Sun album I have one that I made for Rome. I'll probably make a video on that one. I have one for France. So little by little, I now that I'm more comfortable making videos, even though it takes forever to upload. I don't know about you guys, but for me, my God. And my videos are, aren't that long. And I can just imagine uh, ladies that do tutorials that are an hour long and a little bit more. Oh, I don't know how long it takes to upload. But anyway, I enjoy it very much. And I hope you enjoy this. Let me know. Take care of yourself and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.